So we've got a few examples here where we are finding the indicated matrix that's given. So in this case, we want to find A minus B. So let's take a look at that one first. So this is just simple subtraction of matrices. So you basically take one cell of the matrix and you subtract it by its corresponding cell in the other matrix. Okay. Now, the requirements of uh, addition and subtraction are that uh, the matrices are of the same size. Okay, so they don't have to be square, they just have to be m by n, they both have to be the same size. So if they're two rows, three columns, if this is two rows, three columns, the other one has to be two rows, three columns. Okay, in this case, these are both square matrices, meaning same number of rows, same number of columns, so we're, we're good, all right? But in general, to add and subtract matrices, they must be the same size, the same dimensions. Okay, so here, a minus B, so negative 1 minus negative 1, so negative 1 minus negative 1 there is 0, and then you have 0 minus 6, so that's negative 6, then you have 6 minus 3, and that's 3, and then you have 1 minus 1, which is, in this case, 0. So if you look at it here, this is what A minus B looks like. Okay, that's what A minus B looks like. All right, now let's take a look at A. Or I'm sorry, the second example. It says find negative 4A. So all we're going to do, this is just scalar multiplication. We're going to take each of these cells and we are going to multi multiply them by negative 4. So negative 4 times negative 1 is positive 4. Negative 4 times 6 is negative 24. And then we have negative 4 times 5, which is negative 20. And then negative 4 times negative 3, which is positive 12. So that's what that looks like there. That is negative 4a. So take this is the scalar multiplication, if you will. Now in this one, this is kind of like a basic uh, matrix equation. We have uh, find x, where b plus x equals a, right? So let's see, if I'm solving for x, if this was just a general equation, I would say x equals a minus b. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to find a minus b. All right, so let's see what that looks like here. x equal a minus b. All right, let's see. Negative 1 minus 2 that's negative 3, 0 minus 7, that's negative 7, uh, 8 minus 1, that's positive 7. Okay, now take this 3, subtract 1, and we get 2, so 3 minus 1 is 2, 4 minus 4 is 0, negative 4 minus 2 is negative 6, and then we close it off. And so this is what the matrix X looks like. So this is what X is. So if you think about it, if you take B and you add X, you will get these values from A. Okay? So just consider you might want to double check this, but it is correct. It is correct for sure. Uh, but just so that you can have maybe another example, work it the other way. So very simple operations, you know, add, subtract, and scalar multiplication for matrices.